What's up, guys? Oh, yeah, I just decided to check my thing. Anyway, what's up, guys? I'm the Pig Pig Gamer. Welcome back to another video where today we are back in another virtual box tutorial. It has been way too long and it's not lagging. Good. Um, it's been way too long since we done one of these, so I'm really sorry about that. But like I promised, today we are going to show you how to install Windows 3.0 in VirtualBox. So first, of course, you need to get VirtualBox. If you're on Windows, you get this one. If you're on Mac, you get this one. If you're on Linux, you get this one. If you get Sor if you have Source, you get this one. And uh, then after you install it, you should have VirtualBox. And um, yeah, basically this is um. This is, um, some, uh, a, a kind of a long process. I mean, you have to do a bunch of installing, but it shouldn't be that bad. So, first, you have to actually... Okay, these are the operating system I have so far. But, uh, we already showed you how to get Windows XP, and, yeah. Um, so, we want to install MS-DOS in this, like, Windows thing. So, we're just gonna put this 3.1 next. Next. Create next, and just just do all this, and then you go into settings. You all know how to like insert disks and stuff, and storage. Now you need to put uh, a floppy drive in here, and that is uh, not in my stuff. What what was this? I I have no idea what this was. <laughs> it looks very confusing. I I don't know what that was. We need to go on your desktop, and uh, let's see. Where's my Older. All right, here we go. VirtualBox stuff and uh, MS DOS. You need to install MS DOS first in order to be able to run Windows 3.0. So we're just gonna launch this. I'm calling it Windows 3.0 because this is what we're gonna install, of course. So here we go. Make sure my face cam is in the way, so I'll move it over. Uh, yeah, it's still working. I don't think it's gonna lag. All right. Uh, so welcome to setup. Just press enter. And, uh, enter. And, uh, make sure setup disk is in drive A, which it is, so we can enter. And it's gonna start MS-DOS. And it's gonna format your drive C. So, this should go very quickly. I can see the little green in the corner, so I actually got an eye on you. If you don't know why I'm so concerned about it, is because in some of my streams, it's been lagging a lot. But I think it's just okay when I'm recording. Anyway, uh, so, uh, saying, so, yep, I'm in the United States, and, um, so, set up whole place, enter, and then, uh, now I need to put in set up disk, uh, two, so I need to, um, right control, and then, uh, put in set up disk number two, number two, alright, where's, okay, here we go, and disk number two, and then enter, and then, in, it should keep going, or well, yeah, it will ask for disk sub three. So number three, and please remove disk from all floppy drives. So remove the disk and then press enter, and now it's um installed. So um now I think I I kind of forgot what you have to do, but I think you have to do um a. Um, oh jeez, oh jeez, Re reset. <laughs> um, okay, so you don't do A, you do dir. So, we'll, we'll do that real quick. Dir. A. Oh, come on, what do you do? I completely forgot. I completely forgot. I completely forgot what you have to do. So, you launch it up, and what do I have to do? I completely forgot. I think, oh wait. I remember set up dot bat. No, come on! How about we do dir set up set up set up dot bat? No, it's a bad command or file name. Dang it! What if I do d? Inval invalid drive. No, we're already in c. Uh, or is it set up? Just set up to install MS DOS. Insert. Wait, what? I, I completely for, I thought you had to, um, I thought you had to do setup.bat, but apparently it says invalid command. Guys, I'm so sorry, I completely forgot. Oh, I should have had a reference. Um, okay. Like, when I try and do drive A, it doesn't work. See, like, if I try it, it just says abort retry fail. 
Like, and even when I try to answer, I have to reset it because it keeps spamming this message. So if I fail one more time, um, I'm gonna have to cut the video and I'll have to be right back. Oh my gosh, so embarrassing. Okay, still on green, making progress. Okay, let's see what was it. So I try dr drive this. No, it just says invalid drive. What? Oh, let's see. Um, command. Uh, I don't know, guys. I think we finished. Actually, have we actually like finished? And now we have to enter, insert the the Windows thing. Drives. No. <laughs> what do we do? What if I try B? Uh. A no! See, it just look. I'll bore retry fail again. You know, what? I'll be right back. I'll see what's going on. Wait, why did I put up a two? <laughs> it didn't stop recording. Oh, okay. Good. All right, guys, I'm back. <laughs> guys, I can't believe I forgot this. So I'm gonna keep this up as a reference. I'm using everything he pans video, but what I forgot to do. <laughs> was it you have to insert the CD ROM and then enter drive A? <laughs> what is wrong with me? I can't believe I forgot that. And then you type up sev.bat and then <laughs> Wow, I messed up. I actually messed up, so what do you have to do next? Alright, and then we should have MS DOS installed yep there we go ms dos is now installed so now that we finally have installed ms dos now we can um gosh why is... gosh my cold so now we can install windows 3.0 now i completely um forgot how we like oh there we go we just enter the iso <laughs> or do we oh yeah the iso okay so now we uh put in the iso so, we're not installing Windows XP, we're gonna... Oh, there's no ISO. <laughs> so, we're gonna have to do choose disk image 3.0. Oh! Which disk do we choose first? I'm gonna have to... Uh, where's the Windows? Oh my gosh. 3.0. Okay, disk 1. So, yeah, insert disk 1. And, uh, let's see, Disco 1, and then what do you do? You, unpause. I would, um, if, it, if, um, everything EPAN, like, um, cared about people taking his videos, I wouldn't play it, but I don't think he would care about me just watching his video to remember. So, um, I don't think, um, uh, so that's why... That's why I'm playing it because um, I don't think I'll get copyright claimed by everything Epan. So enter, enter, and enter, and then you put in disk two here. Thank gosh I remember that. And enter, and then here we go. The window setup. So we're just gonna um, uncheck these two and then continue. And then we need disk number three. So right control to get out of that. <laughs> And disk number three, and okay. And then we need disk number four, so just right click. Well, not right click, but right control. Uh, disk four, yeah, disk four. And then okay. And disk number five, there's lots of disks you need to put in. And then okay. And we need disk number six. Is number six okay and there we go in order for windows to be installed correctly i'll make all modifications for you okay okay and applications okay and um windows 3.0 you need to reboot replace any replace and strike any human ready oh then you have to uh take out that disk we don't need that I'm, I'm, I'm clicking any key I'm clicking any key I'm clicking any key it won't do anything what do you do next 
Um, I set it up and now it's just saying this, and I'm pressing A key. Go ahead and reboot. Yeah, reboot. It was supposed to come up with this! Why didn't that come up? It All it said was like, remove the disk. Um... Let's see here. I think I might need to put the CD-ROM back in. Let's let's try that. Let's try that. Uh, where is it? Okay, down here. CD-ROM. Ugh. I need to reset. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. All right. Here we go. And then if we type in win. There we go! We got it! <laughs> wow, so I may cut out the parts of the video where I just watch everything in Epan's video, but there we go! We got Windows 3.0. That took kind of a long time, but at least we got it. So, yeah, it, there you go. So, you can, like, go to, you know... Oh, we got games. What games do we have? Uh, Reversey. What's this? It may only move where the cursor is across. Okay, I have no idea how you even play this game, <laughs> but uh, you got that game, and oh, we could go into full screen. I didn't know full screen existed back then. What's solitaire? Oh, it's this card game, this classic card game. And um, we got applications. We can see what time it is. It is. I don't know. I can't tell time that well. And we got notepads, so we can be like, "Hey guys, make a, a tutorial." Now nah, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> we can put a smiley face. Look at that. <laughs> Still look as awesome as they do now. <laughs> Let's see what this one looks like. Well, wow, that actually kind of looks realistic in this version. YouTube. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah, it looks like every um thing you launch gets on your desktop and we got a paintbrush can we like paint stuff oh we can look at this like microsoft paint wow whoa what is this what did i just do oh it's like yeah <laughs> so you can uh draw you can write kind of the same thing <laughs> as uh, the notepad we got a calendar so today yes it is whoa it actually knows where i where my time zone is see look time so yeah it is tuesday february 23rd 2017 for us in the u.s recorder um am I, <laughs> did i just record something did i record a really weird video and let's check out the calculator so let's do one oh where is the multiplication button ah here we go one times eight equals eight. Zero though times Cannot divide by zero! <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm really sorry. How do I clear? Ah, clear. See, if we try and do zero... Yep, can't divide by zero! We do four times six equals... Oh, wait, is that divide? Is this times? Six times six equals... I have no idea. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, guys, that is how to install Windows 3.0. Very easy, but I kind of forgot some stuff. But hey, hopefully I remember to cut out the boring parts and add in the actual setup part. So yeah, guys, anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you do want to see more virtual box tutorials, then please give this video a big fat like. If this happens to be your first video seen created by me, then please subscribe <laughs> to join Team Pig Pig Wolf Cat. <laughs> It goes follow me on Google Plus and Instagram right down there. Hold on, let me try and make a good arrow. Okay, I can't. <laughs> uh, right down there in the description below to see all my supposed to see, to see how I'm doing what I'm doing. Again, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, <laughs> I forgot a lot of stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace! Okay, I need to get out of this.